I've got a cool plant here that I wanted to show. Uh, this one is called Apache Plume, um, Fallugia Paradoxa. And it's called that because it looks like a big Native American or Apache headdress, uh, the fruits. These are actually all the fruits here. If you pull them out, they should have a little seed at the bottom. Um, so that's similar to like a dandelion that has the little uh, pappus, the white fuzz on it that helps it fly. That's kind of what this is used for. It's, uh, it's just got hairs to help with seed dispersal. If we look at the flower, uh, this one actually has a lot of uh, pollinators in it, but this is a rosaceae family. So it's got a lot of uh, stamens in there. You can see how many there are and these pretty white petals. Um, it looks like it has about five here. And uh, you can look at the calyx. It's also got five of the calyx down there. And uh, then it's got a really unique leaf. So if we look in closer at these leaves right here, uh, you can see they've got a lot of little fingers and they're quite fuzzy. You can see lots of little white hairs, uh, easier to see with a hand lens, but uh, you can still see them with the naked eye. If you uh, pull off some of these leaves and look at the underside, you're usually gonna have this orange color. Um, or it can be a little whitish, uh, but it uh, is like a rust color in the uh, underside of the leaf around the veins. So it's a pretty unique one with those fingers and then the underside is rusty. The top is going to be a darker green with some fuzz, um, but it's got these really distinctive uh, fruits and uh, it is a common landscaping plant across New Mexico and West Texas, but it's just a great plant. Uh, overall, uh, it's utilized by wildlife, and uh, it's just a really beauty, a real beauty to find out in the wild. So I'll see you next time as I continue my trekking around the Lincoln National Forest in New Mexico.